Hi, Nurse Sherry here, and today we're gonna to be going over how to use a bladder scanner. So we use these to determine if anybody has residual urine in their bladder after they go to the bathroom or post-surgery. Um, the first thing you're gonna do is power on with this one, uh, the power button's down here, so I select it. Your options are gonna be female, uh, child, female with the H is a hysterectomy because it matters on when you're doing the scanning your results and then male. So we're gonna go with female. We have a female patient here. And I'm gonna, this is the transducer that I'm gonna use to scan it. I'm gonna first apply my gloves. And then I'm gonna take the transducer and you wanna place it one to two inches above the pelvic bone. So I went ahead and just put a pad here or a towel or whatever, just to protect the patient's clothing. And then if you feel right here, you'll feel a pelvic bone and you're gonna go one to two inches above that. Then I'm gonna take my gel and I'm gonna put a large amount on here to check the bladder. All right, when I do this, I look here at my guy and it says, this is the way that it's supposed to be facing. So when I place it down, I wanna make sure that this head portion is facing the head, which it would be this way, but you guys just can't see a picture of it. Okay, so then there's this button here, and I'm gonna press this scan as soon as I get it on the patient, and that's gonna come up to this screen and tell, show me this purple cross and this green line. The purple cross is the bladder, so that's the black circle. So she obviously has some urine in there. And once it gets close to it, it just keeps taking pictures. Then I'm gonna go ahead and hit scan. And then it takes a lot of pictures while it does that. If you look at this circle here and you are in all four corners, at least in the corners, you have an accurate result. So it's saying 821 mils is gonna be what's in her bladder. And so I'm gonna document that 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 was in there after she had uh, went to the bathroom or whatever the situation is or why you're doing it. And then to clean this, you're gonna just take a sanitary cloth and wipe off the gel. And I'm gonna wipe the whole thing down. You just use these wipes to wipe everything down and you can use them to wipe that down as well. And that's just how you would clean it after you're done using it. And just don't forget to document the amount of urine that was left in the bladder. All right, thanks for watching.